Six stairs to close, and, uh, not to expect thanks. They shouldn't have been open in the first place. She is not wrong. The gateway got buried. I have to. <laughs> What's wrong? Without you, I got reckless, overconfident, made stupid mistakes. I don't know why I thought I could do this alone. You were right. No. On our journey together. You have grown into a warrior, worthy of your namesake. I was the one who was not ready. You don't have to be who you were just because I'm not there. Let's make a promise. I'll listen for your voice in my head when you're not there to guide me. And you do the same. All right? I need to know you'll be okay without me. I 
am sorry. Don't be sorry, father. Be better. Let's go home. Do you want to take care of anything before going back to Sindri's? No. First, we retrieve Mamir. Then you can tell us what you learned in Asgard. After that, we shall see. You really do think of him as a brother. What about Freya? Seems like she moved in while I was away. Once she turned her hatred back to Odin, she recognized our interests were aligned. Huh. I tried convincing her of that, but... When was that? Oh. Before I started telling you where I was that night. I see. Hey, she didn't kill me. I said nothing. back. How did it go? The beast should travel us no further. Well, that's our bloody relief. So you put down old Garm, did you? Yeah. Sort of. Atreus, your decision to go to Asgard after all he's put us through. I'll never understand it. But I hope you at least came back with something we can use. I hope so, too. Come on. Let me show you what Odin's up to. Here's what he cares about most. More than Ragnarok or anything, is this mask. Anyone recognize it? That thing? Ugh, oh, it's a dead end. He's been faffing around with that since before I knew him. To be honest, I thought the giants were just having a laugh with that one. Okay, fine. No. You're wrong, Mimir. This mask is no fraud. The giants didn't make it, and only a few of them ever glimpsed it in their visions. They never knew its origin, but some believed it was a way to gaze into the secrets of creation itself. Is it an oracle? Much, much more. Imagine becoming one with a source of infinite knowledge. This? This is why Odin tortured me. So what do you think? Know it? No. It's one obsession he never saw fit to share with me. But I'll tell you this. Even when Odin speaks the truth, his purpose is false. Either way, it's a mistake to let it distract us. Is Heimdall our focus or not? We will rewrite our fate another way. Then I'm going back to Vanaheim. If we're not taking the fight to Odin, I should help my brother stand against him. We will join her when we can. I'm gonna study my notes on the mask, see if I can think of a plan. But if you want to go anywhere, 
I'm with you. And let's go. Well said, Tia. I believe you just might. Brother, don't you check on fair. Is there any unfinished business in other realms you wanted to take care of? I'm sure the lad would love to help. Let's make something then. Get so much as a paper cut in that. You won't get so much as a paper cut in that. Need something special? And the kid? <laughs> what are you looking for? Take your crap. Hand it over already. Yeah, yeah. 
Polish up real nice. I'll toss it on the pile. Save me the trouble of getting it myself. Yeah, I'll take your crap. Hand it over already. You are well. Take more than a porch full of bone John stiffs to keep me down. What am I gonna do? Walk around with a bandage on my head, begging for attention? I was mauled by a bear. Nudged, more like it. Hey, wait. We're with you. He's going to want whatever lead work you have, so, you know, it's a time already. We travel to Vanaheim. Great. You gonna check in on Freya? Yes. Glad I get to come this time. So what happened the last time you were in Vanaheim? I still don't know how you got Freya to stop trying to kill you. We traveled to her village to break Odin's spell. Once freed, she accepted that I was not her enemy. You also missed a highly entertaining moment where Brock was lifted ass over face in Freya's camp. You met Freya? What's he like? Different from his sister. Lacks her conviction. True. But he's a bit quicker to forgive. And an ineffective leader. But his heart's in the right place. You'll like him, lad. Wow. It's beautiful. And, uh, what? It is also dangerous. More dangerous than hell? Freya's camp is to the right. No rush, is that? Not every day the lad gets to see a new realm. <laughs> oh dear. What? Nothing, it's just... We're not far from Freya's wedding site. It was a delightful day. Aside from her brother's outburst, of course. That sounds pretty personal. Think you should go there with Freya? Oh, not a bad idea, that. Amir, did you see these settlements before they fell apart? Aye, beautiful they were. A thriving river community, helping pilgrims on their way to the Great Shrine. Oh, almost a mercy Freya's not around to see the state of it.
I'm assuming those people aren't friendly. I believe you assume right, lad. Razor could help. Nice. Good thing that bridge survived the fall. Another bridge. Think you can lower it?
Anything illuminating? Looks like there's something hanging from the tree above us. Wonder if that could help. We can use that. How are we going to get the fire from one side to the other? shot the chandelier with the sigil arrow. We could move the fire across that way.
It's good! To Freyr's camp, then. Time to see how the Vanir have fared in our absence. I hope Freya's okay. She can care for herself. We're still checking on her, though? Her brother's forces are outnumbered. There is much I owe her. 
Reminds me of a Vanaheim song I heard long ago. No one here. Where is everyone? Stay alert. I don't like this, brother. Kratos, Atreus, a welcome reunion. Unexpected, but welcome. You know us? Can't be. Is that who I think? Oh, you shifty bastard. It's almost good to see you again. And for once in the shape of a man, or nearly. So that's how they got your head out of your ass. Maybe now you'll stop being such a half-blind, piss-drunk, oversexed liar. He was more of a pig than I ever was. I do not know you. Do you not recognize your handiwork? Hildis Vini! Remember when we first met Frey in the woods? After I... Oh... I am so... so sorry about that. Freya's poor. Her advisor... and friend. Counselor to the Vanir. And yes, while exiled at Midgard, I was trapped in my boar form. And then you shot me. At my command. No. My arrow, my mistake. Forgotten. Vanaheim needs our help more than ever. Even Mimir's. Come. Just watch where you aim that bow of yours. My hide's not so thick in this form. We can head out whenever you're ready. Where are we going? I have a favor to ask. I'll explain on the way. Where's Freya? She came here to help her brother. She leads the search party for Freyr and Bigvir. They've been captured by the Einherjar. How did that happen? An ambush. Their presence has intensified since your last visit. To make matters worse, the Celestial Wolves haven't been seen in days. Or at least I assume. Not easy, tracking time with no moon in the sky. No moon. Just like in their shrine. Their shrine? It's a long story. You want us to check on them? You have my gratitude. We're spread thin, and if anyone can help Skoll and Hati, he'd be a fellow giant. Very well. Freya mentioned you had a way past this. <laughs> you don't disappoint. Continue down this path and you'll find their den. Good luck. And don't shoot any boar! You think he's really forgiven me for shooting him? Trust me, lad. The old swine still carried a grudge. You'd know it. What happened between you two? The usual. Miscommunication, conflicting loyalties, broken promises. <laughs> Nothing to concern yourself with. I'm not concerned. Just curious. Curiosity's all well and good. But so is privacy. Huh? Okay, okay. Point taken.
and feels so different from the other realms. It's warm, like Svartalfheim, but there's a kind of thickness in the air. Hmm. Egros. Uh, what? Egros. Greek. For humid. Egros. I like it. Doubtful. 
You know, lad, this excursion into Vanaheim means you've now visited each of the Nine Realms. Huh. Guess you're right. Not many mortals can claim such a feat. Not many gods either. Even your father has yet to grace the halls of Asgard. I'm in no hurry to do so. Thought his Vini said both Frey and Bigvir were captured. Bigvir's the light elf who wanted to learn more about that library in Alfheim, right? Correct. An exiled scholar married to a warrior, Bela. I was the exile. I had to ask him for a full tale, but I take it that he and Bela's quest to unite their people was frowned upon. Wait, Bela's a dark elf? Yes. Wow. Well, that raises even more questions. He's okay.
Ragnarok begins when Skull and Hati catch the sun and moon, right? I said it was foretold, lad. Prophecy. Which, after our time with the Norns, we've all had quite enough of. But Odin still believes. That's gotta be why the Einherjar stole the moon. He's still trying to avoid Ragnarok. Or he prepares for it. Fights a proxy war in this realm to distract his enemies. Yeah. Or that, I guess. I can sense them up there. It's gotta be their den. Excited to meet Skull and Hati, lad. I mean, I've heard all your stories. It's gonna be weird meeting them in person. Legend meeting reality. At the very least, it shouldn't fail to entertain. <clears throat> uh, hello? I think they're sleeping. Well, there you have it. The legendary celestial wolves, supremely entertaining as promised. Remember their shrine? They didn't rejoin the sky until after the moon returned. And then chased an arrow across the sky. Right. Well, guess we go find the moon and put it back where it belongs, eh? As if that's a perfectly normal thing to say. The Aenor Yar played a part according to Skull and Hati's shrine. Managed to stuff the moon inside a box, if memory serves. But it didn't say where they took the box. Aye, that's the rub of using prophecy as a map, isn't it? Bit sparse on the details. There's a war camp in the nearby village. A strong fortress to guard their bounty. We will try there first. But besides Hildas Vini and the elves, who else is part of Freyr's army? Not much army, really. <laughs> Although Beergirl was a soldier, once walking the path of a traveler. I imagine he's handy with that enormous broken sword of his. A traveler that doesn't want to kill us. That's nice. Ain't <laughs> your head. I'm ready. 
Ne emulgere sattere nero. Alfarelle e I can't believe no one's here. They hide. The Vanir aren't all hardened warriors like our dear Freya. Those who survive the warfare find it easier to hide in the jungle and use nature as their shield. Get to it from up here. Go! 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 Go!
Hoping that puts a dent in Odin's forces, at least for the time being. I don't think Asgard's running out of soldiers anytime soon. Ready to put the moon back where it belongs? Okay, yeah. That is a weird thing to say. Another ambush? Really? Third time's the charm. They are not smart. I understand that. <laughs> you know, what we're doing right now, all of this, it's almost exactly how we saw it play out back in Skull and Hathi Shrine. The wolves are back in Vanaheim. We're rescuing the moon. Yes. I remember the prophecy. So, doesn't it make you worried? Everything we're doing now happened in the Yonar Shrine? Remember our agreement. Prophecy will not dictate our actions. Yeah. Our allies need help. That is our focus now. Whoa! What is that? Go on, nasty beast! Go on! Oh, 
What is that? A wide one. Nasty beast. Just a wide. The upper. Audience attack. Watch out. Left side. Cold. Is this? It's from Helheim. Heimdall must have grabbed this while I freed Garm. Ugh. I was there, but I, I didn't know. And now you fight to undo the damage. Your guilt is misplaced. Yeah. No, you, you're right. We can return to the den through here. They will pursue. Keep your guard up. Father, how are you so sure we even have a choice about what we're doing? Doubt is a weakness we cannot afford. Who said anything about doubt? So far, we've done everything the Giants said we would. We make our own choices. Nothing forces us. Go! Oh. 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 
Careful, brother. You're covered in my blood. <laughs> Walking straight into Ragnarok. Isn't there any way to avoid fate? Your fate? What if we can't stop you from. Would you turn your back on the wolves? On this realm? Remember our agreement. The lad does make some good points, though. As long as Atreus lives. So be it. Here goes nothing. like inside their shrine. If I do this... Fate only binds you if you let it. Do what is necessary. Not because it is written. Call them anytime we need them. Remember that altar we saw when we first got here? I think that's where we're supposed to use it. Hmm. Perhaps Freya will know. So, in essence, they just gave us the keys of dusk till dawn. Not bad for a day's work. We should head back to Hilda's Pini and tell him about all this. Yeah? Yes. Back to the camp. <laughs> wow. This place changes at night. A lot. No less humid, unfortunately. Look out! 
wasn't the same one from earlier, was it? No. They come back fast. Not that fast. In Asgard, what else did you see of Odin's army? Well, all these Anhuryar we've been fighting, they've already died in battle once. We kill them here, and they'll just wake back up in Valhalla. They never truly die. Should it come to war, we do well to have our own endless army of dead soldiers. You mean Helheim's army, like the prophecy said. It will not come to that.
Gross. We can get across from up here. We report back to Hildesfini, then what? We came here to help Freya. We will not leave without rescuing her brother and the Light Elf. Okay, but Odin's not gonna stop searching for mask pieces. That is his concern, not ours. Sure, but if that mask offers all the answers... Then it will surely exact a price. Be wary of your shortcuts knowledge. Yes, brother. <laughs>
Do all the plants here want to kill us? No, no. Only the carnaptious ones. Who's that? Ah, that wrinkly mug belongs to Helka. She's a blowfinder. Hounds prized for their pinpoint accurate tracking abilities. Mm. You'll love her. Mm. Kratos, Atreus. That eclipse was your doing, I take it. Thank you for coming. Big Vir used the diversion to escape. What about your brother? We know where they're holding him now. Bela's already prepped the explosives. If you're with me, we can leave as soon as you're ready. I could use another shapeshifter's help. Go with him, Atreus. I will aid Freya. Yes, sir. The fuse is but 30 heartbeats. That's enough. Once you see the signal, count it down. The wolves gave us a scepter. 